the songs that I'm playing right now. Um, it's not important. Thank you all so much for, for coming out tonight to see the very first ever performance of The Elevator Boy. Yeah! yeah. So, um, you already know this, but uh, this winter term, Jackson and I were. Uh, this winter term, Jackson and I were uh, living outside Chicago, seeing a lot of improv, a lot of sketch um, uh, in downtown Chicago, a lot of stuff at the Second City, a lot of stuff at um, Improv Olympic and some other places. So um, we're going to do one act some, of sketch, one act of improv. Yeah, some sketch and some improv for you. We're going to do some sketch and then we're going to have a break. And then we're going to do some improv. So, okay, so let's just get. Brian ready. Weaver, Jackson Zinro, the yes. uh, Yeah, okay. So um, all of us here, almost all of us here are. Overland students, right? I'm an Overland student, Jackson. We're all Overland students, right? As Overland students, we're proponents for change, where we're, we're supporters of the, the issues of our generation, of social justice, and all these and things. And one of the ways uh, that this manifest is pushed back against our uh, President Martin McChrystal. Yeah, some, some of which is very much to deserve. I mean, he's not doing everything that he can. He's not. He's an asshole. Sure, he might be an asshole, but let's let's be real. So he's got what? He's got a board of trustees. Yeah, he, he's facing a lot of issues. It's not a system that's conducive to change. You and, know, uh, people uh, and yesterday he oh, saved it over from a terrorist attack. What yeah, by going back in time. Yeah, so let's talk about that. <laughs> Five years ago on August 24th, 1960. He came out of his mama, then the legend began, started as a boy, now he's a man. In 1982, he graduated from college. His brain was loaded up with time machine knowledge, time traveling every night by day along. He was the first man to make a time machine work, yeah, Marvin. Marvin Chrislaw, American hero, American man. Oh no, the terrorists are coming. If anyone can save us, Marvin Chrislaw can. Two, three, four. Fast forward 30 years to yesterday morning. On Marvin's desk appeared. Good morning. How you doing, Marv? We're gonna bomb your school. Oh no, oh no. There ain't nothing you can do. He has terrorists. As he moved the desk chair Then he opened the hatch into a secret lair He'd given up science to become a college dean His break was over, he jumped into that time machine Yeah, Marvin, you're our salvation Save us from exploding Stewart. He said, hey, fellas, I've got terrorists to thwart. Mr. Marvin of the future will do whatever you say. you got to build this campus in a bomb-proof way. Okay. Well, they reinforced the windows with bulletproof glass. Marvin fell in love with an 1800s lass. Her name was Clara. She was pleasant. She was smart. She worked her way into our president's heart. Yeah, Marvin. What's your mother, but still loves you, and we never have to know. You can't stay with her, that's not your real life. Yeah, we miss you, Marvin, would you please come home? Yeah, we miss you, Marvin, would you please come home?